Dear Mr. President Ramaphosa. We have never refused to negotiate. Dear friends, not we. But the leadership of Ukraine announced that it would not conduct any negotiations, moreover, the incumbent president of Ukraine signed a corresponding decree prohibiting him from conducting these negotiations. Therefore, I understand your concern, I share it, and, of course, we are ready to consider any of your suggestions, but we did not refuse negotiations. The Ukrainian side refused them. And they even issued a decree. I want to draw your attention to the fact that with the assistance of the same President Erdogan, as you know, the whole series of negotiations between Russia and Ukraine took place in Turkey to develop confidence-building measures. The draft of this agreement was previously signed by the head of the negotiating group from Kiev. He put his signature there. Here it is. It is called the Treaty on Permanent Neutrality and Security Guarantees for Ukraine. It is about the guarantees that you mentioned, dear friend, President of the Republic of South Africa, 18 articles. It was previously signed by the Kiev delegation, there is a signature here, but, as we promised them, after we withdrew the troops from Kiev, the Kiev authorities, as their owners usually do, they refused it. Where is the guarantee that they will not continue to refuse any other agreements?